Aloha, we're here out in Hawaii, Hawaii Shopping Center. We're looking at uh, the Mitsubishi my car. It's Hawaiian Electrics with a nice logo. Uh, we're out here for uh, electric vehicle. Uh, this is another Hawaiian event. electric vehicle. This is a Nissan Leaf. Again, here's that beautiful logo. It's a great day out here. Village Center. Cutter Mitsubishi, they have another one of these uh, nice little i cars. Some of the EV enthusiasts out here today. We have uh, Peter Rozek with Hawaiian Electric, uh, Chris, and uh, John Sumbersurf. John is also with Hawaiian Electric. So here's a closer look at the Better Place Charger. Uh, level 2, it has two charge ports, and uh, you probably have seen some of these signs popping up in the uh, Honolulu parking lots, uh, reserved parking, electric vehicles only, and uh, for one year, if you're an EV owner, you can contact Better Place and you'll get a, uh, a car to uh, charge, maybe a uh, up to I think it's four hours per day uh, and uh, it's free for one year so maybe until March of uh, next year EV owners you'll, you'll be able to charge for free. This by the way is not a gas cap so it's tight plug it in and you just touch it you hear that little uh, beep there and that means it's starting to charge and you can see uh, little indicator lights are beginning to blink and it's uh, starting to charge right now. We'll let uh, Chris Tam here from Mitsubishi, Cutter Mitsubishi Ford, give an explanation of the, the iCar or iMe. It's so, actually hey, this is Kevin from uh, Better Place. He's uh, one of the guys who, uh, who put this wonderful charge station up out here. And uh, so, what, Kevin? How's it going? Aloha, yes. Super stoked to be here. Yeah, it's, uh, the CV Radio Grant project's been a great project. And, uh, Hawaii Reserves played a big role in it. We have a few. We have a few on the North Shore, and we're growing. Um, there's one here. There's one up in Polynesian Cultural Center. There's three in Turtle Bay. Um, and obviously this part of the island is really important to have electric power so if people want to drive out they have a, they have a place to charge while they're out here on the beautiful North Shore. Great. Thanks Kevin. <laughs> this is Jimmy Yao. He's, he's Mr. EV for Hawaiian Electric Company. See Hawaiian Electric Company. He is, uh, uh, if you go to goev.com on the internet, go goev.hiko.com or call 543-GO-EV, 543-GO-EV, you can talk to Jimmy and he'll answer all your questions about EVs, EV charging, and our special EV charging rates. As you can see, he's very customer focused, he's talking to customers right now.
as you're getting three or four people here who can talk about what's going on and you know to people that come up in it. And if they're you know if if they're people that you recognize or somebody that you recognize Okay. And if possible, I think it's great if you could just leave that that vehicle there as well. Yeah. So you wanna have one as a John here is going to um, start up the leaf, and uh, there's no place to put the key. It's, it's really just a fob to just uh, open and close the door. And um, so John's going to press the on-off button. Just release the brake and put into reverse. There's uh, just happens to be a built built in camera on this one where you can actually see the, uh, the reversal. And John's going to put into eco mode, so he uh, pressed it twice. And we got 58 miles left on the battery. I think that's plenty to get back. Nice uh, little GPS tells us where we're at, and uh, I don't know if you can not hear it, but this car is very, very quiet. Here we are. We're on the road uh, going out from Laie back towards the the windward side. A little overcast, a little breezy, but uh, actually it turned out to be no rain today, which was nice. This is the uh, Polynesian Cultural Center, and um, it just so happens that just so happens that they have a better place charge station in here as well. Kalihi and we are down to 11 miles. 